I don't appreciate being stereotyped. Chill out. It's not like I said you eat dogs. Damn, Darman. Okay. Now we're now we're turning it up a notch. Holy shit, Darman. I didn't know Darman could reach that level of edge. That's insane. All right, ladies and gentlemen, it's your favorite Mexican raincoat here. Hope you're all doing well today. I'm not doing too bad myself. Today we're checking in with Darman, my guy, the man, the myth, the legend, Daddy Darman. I read your guys' comments. You guys missed this series, so I'm bringing it back, and I also need views. So like the video right now, or else I'll be showing up to your house and I'll be dropping off a skunk on your front porch. Okay, like the damn video. Anyways, the video we're reacting to today is mean girls shame teens for being asian we're really ending racism with this one y'all anyways i'm not gonna waste more of your time grab your popcorn it's gonna be a long one let's watch another day at darman high school hey i'm not gonna lie since the last time i watched darman he must have upped his budget or something like that this looks way more professional or maybe i'm just a fucking old head who knows You just totally ruined my shoes. Are they really ruined though? Shit, you could put those in the washing machine and they'd be just fine. <gasps> Ew. Look at yours. Of course you don't understand. Those shoes would probably look better with coffee spilled all over them. <laughs> <laughs> Was that supposed to be a joke? The shoes are white, so they wouldn't look good if something spilled on them. Stupid. <laughs> At least your parents are getting you those Gucci shoes for your birthday. They're gonna look so good on you, Megan. <laughs> Who the f*** is this? Megan's D1 Glazer or something? Get her out of here. I know. Definitely gonna need a new pair now. I'm so sorry. It was an accident. I I'm new here and just looking for my class. Do you guys know where room 302 is? The rooms are numbered. Yeah, no shit. Wait, of course you can't see them. Oh, no. Their eyes are too oh, small. Oh, no. <laughs> bro, if any Asians are watching, isn't that like an outdated ass racist joke? Because it's like, bro, I think most people by this point in 2024 understand that Asians can see just fine. I don't know why people still make that dumb ass joke. <laughs> <laughs> That's whack. Forget about it. Excuse me, can you help me find... We got the Rizzler here, or what? Yeah, what's up? Um... Can I help you? Uh... Sorry, I actually gotta go, but I hope you find whatever you're looking for. Slow your roll, new girl. Oh, she's yeah. jealous. Jake only dates hot girls, not girls who look like they rolled out of bed and into a ditch. Bro, why are these insults all so weak? You look like you just rolled out of bed. What are you talking about? <laughs> Good one. <laughs> shake it off. Shake it off. Don't let it get to you. Hi. Oh, is this a trigonometry? You made it. You must be our new student. Everyone, this is Anne. She's new to Herman Prep. Uh, it's actually on, uh, but Anne is fine too, I guess. Okay, I'll make a note of that. Why don't you take a seat next to Megan? Oh no, Megan's plotting right now. You already know it. You can see the evil in her face. Mm. You could have told me you were in this class so I could follow you. Why would I help someone who ruined my shoes? Look, I'm sorry. It was an accident. I didn't uh, mean to. Why don't you try? Can you give me measure of angle T to the nearest tenth? Uh... 45? That is incorrect. The answer is 35.5. Yes. I'll be right there. Why don't you all work on the next problem and I'll be right back. I thought Asians were supposed to be No, oh, I knew it. Fucking goddamn it. We're really picking out of the bottom barrel of racist jokes here, aren't we? Just going straight into the stereotypes. I don't appreciate being stereotyped. Chill out. It's not like I said you eat dogs. Damn, Darman. Okay, now we're now we're turning it up a notch. Holy shit, Darman. I didn't know Darman could reach that level of edge. That's insane. Wouldn't be surprised if in two weeks you just see on Twitter, Darman canceled. I was complimenting Asians. You're more like the less rich, bland version of London Tipton. <laughs> oh, yeah? Well, you look like, um, I can't think of any. From Sweet Life? Wow, 
and you're uncultured. <laughs> Just, never mind. Hey, can you help me with this problem? Sure. <laughs> I'm not laughing at the scene, I'm laughing at the violin that came in. You can sit with me if you want. You know what would be really cool? If Darman made these two girl groups battle it out to the death. Thanks, I'm Anne. It's my first day here. Oh, welcome, I'm Kim. Whoa, are those stocks? I built an algorithm based on decades of data. Damn, bro, what type of plot is this, bro? Motherfuckers be getting rich in high school. Is that like a thing people do in high school nowadays? Are motherfuckers just really in the lunchroom on stocks? Y'all let me know in the comments down below. The buy and sell stocks quickly for profit. It actually has a shockingly high success rate, which helps me buy cool things. Okay, got the rake. That's so cool. Are all of your friends into stocks too? Yo, why is she putting on that face? Are all, Are all of, of your friends, friends into, into stocks, stocks too? too? Passive aggressive ass face. I actually don't really have any friends. I'm kind of just a floater here. I do my own thing. Damn, is Darman high school racist to Asian people? That's crazy. Asians can't have shit around here, bro. You don't have friends? But how? You're like really pretty. You're clearly smart. You seem like you have things going well for you. You're like the total package. I guess that's kind of the problem. Also, it doesn't help that I'm only Asian at school. Well, until now. The social dynamics at this school are so weird. Tell me about it. Everyone here only hangs out in cliques. Here, let me break it down for you. Bro, I don't know about y'all, but my high school was majority white people and there was hella racist people there. But then again, I live in Kansas, so I mean, kind of makes sense. That's like our little stereotype. The state with hella white people and hella racist people. That's what people said about my high school, at least. I never saw any racism for myself, so I can't say for sure if it was or wasn't, but I remember hearing stories from others. Those are the band geeks. You can typically find them in the band room early in the morning practicing. Their entire lives revolve around music. Hey, shout out my band geeks, bro. I was a band geek. And annoying others. Those are drama club kids. They can be dramatic. Hey, at least it's entertaining. Oh, woe is me. Then there's the goths. They all hate being at this private school and typically just skip class. Hold up, bro. Is that Ryan Garcia? What are you what are you doing here? Why are you so serious, bruh? Chill out. Honestly, even the faculty skip at them. But in my opinion, they're pretty harmless. <laughs> the skate punks are another story though. You can find them after school on campus skateboarding. <laughs> and vandalizing hey, something. Yo. Run. Then there's the popular girls. They're three of the richest girls in school. Definitely oh, stay away from them. I used to be friends with them, but they're a fake and used me before kicking me to the curb. Tell you. The only person that you have to stay away from more than the popular girls is Jake. Jake. Let's just say he's not a good guy. Yeah, Jake is a muir. And he has a bad reputation. <laughs> Commentary video title last scene. Well, I've been misjudged before. Reputations aren't always right. True. Unless you know something from personal experience. I'd rather not talk about it. Oh, damn. She's got a story. She's got an allegation. Hey, Jake. Are you excited for my end of the school year bash? End, end of the school year what? End of the school year bash? Is that what we're calling parties now, chat? Hey, let me know down below. It's where all the popular kids go to. Megan always throws it. Trust me. You don't want to go. Well, if Megan's throwing it, I'd never be invited. It's pretty much everything you need to know. And if you need anything, let me know. Well, actually, I could use your help with a couple things. I can't figure this out. I know, I know. Everyone's shocked because I'm Asian and I don't fit into the genius stereotype. You are smart. You're just not using the right formula. 
You need the inverse trigonometric ratio. Oh, that makes a lot more sense. Thanks. Hey, you know what? I will say the plot and the direction and everything about like the production quality and stuff like that, bro, it's getting better from Dara, man. Let's just... I mean, for real, bro, I'm watching and I'm interested. I don't know about y'all, but I'm ready for life lessons. You've been to all these places? Yeah, I love traveling. I'm actually planning a trip to Europe after school's out. Damn! You should come with me. <laughs> I wish. I've never been out of the country. I'd love to travel, but I don't have that kind of money. Well... I might have a solution. Damn, is she really about to get put on like that? Okay, then. I might just have to get my notebook out now. I'm gonna be learning stocks 101, chat. Darman dropping the gems, question mark? I could give you the algorithm I use so you can make money if you want to come to Europe with me. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. What do you mean the algorithm? I could give you the algorithm I use. Wait so a second. Is this like the CEO of stocks or something? The Seriously? algorithm? That'd be awesome. Thanks. We could travel and take pictures. I'd probably ruin them. They're so much prettier than me. I don't even know how to put on mascara properly. Don't worry, I can teach you. And once you start making some money, we can go shopping together for everything for our trip. Deal? Deal. Animatronic ass movements. Yo, yo. <laughs> Why am I going crazy? This scene is long as hell, but basically she glows up. She gets a makeover. And she also gets the Gucci. Oops. I mean, Chanel. A seatball sounds like Chanel. Hey, on, right? Um, I like your new look. <laughs> Damn, bro pulled up immediately. Oh, shit. <laughs> my boy, yo, I'm about to turn my mic volume down. Hey, let me know if you like it bass boosted, though. Let me know if I should start doing distorted commentaries. You know, I was wondering if you ever tutored because I was hoping to get my grades up. Hell, really? Bro, it's not so so much. Duke Dennis. Yeah. <laughs> That's for sure. Most people tend to think I'm dense just because I'm an athlete, but there's so much more to me than any of them know. But there's so much more to me than any of them know. Makes me sad when people misjudge me before getting to know the real me. I completely understand what you mean. I feel the same way. You're an athlete too? <laughs> no, silly. People tend to stereotype me because I'm Asian. I guess we have a lot in common. <laughs> Jake biting the curb 8K. Can I get your phone number? Yeah. Ew. She's totally trying to move in on your guy. It's whatever. I'm not bothered by it. Jake's gonna be all mine by the end of the bash anyways. Speaking of, how are your parents letting you throw another party after what happened last year? What happened last year? Damn! Hey! That's our house! We're gonna call the cops! Is Megan throwing a party? <laughs> Did you hear me? How are your parents letting you throw another party? Are you kidding me? They have no idea. They're out of town. If they found out, they'd kill me. Wait, but if they don't know, then how are we going to pay for it? We can't use their card. Ashley. I have an idea. Dan. Yeah. Nice shoes. Jojo Siwa looking at. How'd you get them? I know they're like super expensive. Yeah. Um, Kim taught me how to buy and sell stocks to save up for a Europe trip. So you're like, what, super rich now? <laughs> That's so cool. Yeah, no, this plot is insane so far, bro. This high schooler got bullied for being Asian three different times on the first day of school and then meets a friend that just so happens to be the CEO of stocks. Like, how many high schoolers are really just out here randomly getting rich off of stocks? It's gotta be, what, like 0.001% or something? Like, this plot is crazy. So random. Hey, you should totally come to my party because Jake's gonna be there. And I'll help you talk to him. Oh, wow. okay. You will? I see her game now. This is what she was scheming the entire time. Remember how I said this girl was plotting in class? This is what she plotted out. Yeah. And you should totally help me co-host the party and run it with me. Are you down? No. 
Yeah, I've never thrown a party before, but it sounds fun. Okay, let's talk numbers. So with the food, drinks, decor, and DJ, it'll probably be around five grand. Nothing for a super successful stock investor. Oh shit, run, she's gonna take your money. Um, and since you are co-hosting, you don't mind paying, right? Hey, Em, can I talk to you for a minute? What are you doing? Megan's clearly using you. It's not what it seems. She's actually really nice. She even offered to talk to Jake for me. Oh no. Jake? Seriously? I told you he's not a good guy. He's not what you think. He has a bad reputation, but I'm not basing it off of that. I'm basing it off of my personal experience with him. This is the moment, chat. Is she gonna be a snake or is she gonna be a good friend? Comment down below, bro. And can you come here? We have a question. So, we were thinking to go shopping after school. Wanna come? But we don't have any money. Oh, right. That is a good idea. And you have to come with us. You do want to get something super new and cute for your hangout with Jake, right? Yeah. Okay, let's talk about it on the way to class. Come on. She's a snake? Oh, nah. That's tough. <sighs> June 15th can't come soon enough. I can't wait to show off our new dresses. Oh, no. June 15th? That's the day I'm supposed to go to Europe. Slight flex. <sighs> I don't think I can help with the party after all. Bummer. You can't be serious. Yeah. That's no way to treat your new friend, now is it? Bruh, y'all just Plus, met. Europe can wait. This is the last bash I'm throwing before we all graduate. Fuck your bash, it's Europe, what? Hey, shout out to France. I guess that's a fair point. Hopefully Kim will understand. Damn, so she's just gonna cancel plans just like that, bruh? She's acting like a fake friend. That'll be 524 and 98 cents, please. Oh no, I'm a total klutz. Oh, she's about to make some bullshit up. Got Listen. My credit card. Do you girls have yours? Oh my god. <laughs> Must have forgotten mine at home. No. Oh, I actually forgot mine too. Oh wow. What are we gonna do? <laughs> Leave the store. We won't have anything to wear for the party. This will ruin everything. Good. Unless you could maybe spot us. Hell no. We'll pay you back. Bro, they're about to hit a lick on you. You guys aren't using me, are you? Yes. That's the fakest head shake I've ever seen. Kim said that. Kim? You can't listen to her. She's just jealous because Jake started talking to you. You know, they used to date, but Jake broke up with her because she was way too possessive. Okay, so basically, this girl is a manipulative freak. I do not see this ending well. No. Are you serious? Yeah. He tried to get with Megan, but she turned him down. Mm -hmm. Lies! But Kim blames her for breaking them up. She even started all these mean rumors to get people to not like Megan. Even though the breakup wasn't Megan's fault. You can't listen to anything she says. Your true friends choose you, not use you. Bruh, I find it so ironic how she says that as she's using her. Why do you think Kim has no friends? Clearly, she's using you so that she's not a total loner, but we're choosing to bring you into our circle. That's the difference. Mm -hmm. Man, shut your dumb ass. So, can you be a true friend and spot us? Please. Don't do it. Oh my god. Dumbass, you're gonna learn later. You. Just wait. Just wait until later. You're gonna see. Oh no. Hey. Oh no. Are you gonna say anything to me? You can drop the act, Kim. <clears throat> you never cared about me. <clears throat> I know all about how you and Jake used to date. <clears throat> and you were completely wrong about Megan and them. <clears throat> They're not the problem. You are. Oh, shit. And stop being so possessive. I can like whoever I want and be friends with whoever I want. I'm gonna go grab us some drinks, okay? I'll be right back. Uh, don't go anywhere. Don't go anywhere. Okay. Bruh is the Rizzler. Morning is now complete. We should be taking off shortly. She's 
down bad. Wait, you're Kim's friend, right? I'm surprised to see you're hanging with Jake after everything he did to her. That was just a rumor. That's not what it seems. Okay, I'm confused. I've heard so many different things. What exactly happened? Jake and Kim dated for a little over a year. Let's go. Now we get the real story. Everyone could tell that Kim really liked him. And it seemed like he liked her too. Blood does not have good intentions. You can see it in his eyes. But turned out Jake was really just a player. Blood belongs to the streets. He had multiple girlfriends from different cliques and used them to help him with different things like Damn, bro, must have been watching a whole lot of Andrew Tate or some shit, eh? You must have four wives, and I'll tell you why. When Kim found out, she broke up with him. He wasn't happy. So, to get even, he spread rumors about how she was possessive just because she didn't want to get cheated on. Oh, shit. So... She was right the whole entire time, and she was just the manipulative one. Who could have guessed? Who could have predicted this? Look, I shouldn't be saying anything because I'm at her party, but Megan isn't what she seems. You'll see. <gasps> What's going on oh. in here? Are you guys seriously doing this? Bruh. You're supposed to be my friend. Nope. <laughs> friend wow you really are dumb <laughs> you realize i was just using you to help pay for the party right hey that's why you don't trust racist people and become friends with them they might just scam you and jake doesn't even really like you now do you babe look i mean you're cute and all but i just need some help with my homework wait you didn't think i actually liked you did you why did bro just hit her with a you thought i was feeling you <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's a hoot. What a loser. <laughs> Thanks for the dresses. And paying for everything. Damn. Your call has been forwarded to... We apologize for the delay. We expect it to be another 15 minutes before our departure. We appreciate your patience. Is that seat taken? Look, I'm so sorry. I should have never listened to Megan and them. You had my back the entire time, and I will never take our friendship for granted ever again. Will you please forgive me? I know how deceptive they can all be. So, yes, I forgive you. I'm so glad you came. Wait a minute. I thought you spent all your money on the party. How'd you afford the ticket? Well, after canceling the DJ and the food, luckily I had a little bit left over. And I left Megan a little surprise. Hmm. Oh, this song has played like five times already. Where's the DJ? And everyone's hungry. Where's the food? I don't know, okay? It was supposed to be here like an... Oh, finally, that must be the catering. Where's the rest of it? That little... <gasps> what? Hey, is that my car? Yes, that is your car. <sighs> really? Uh, so I guess the lesson out of all of this is just like, don't be racist, I guess. I, I don't even know what the lesson was, to be honest. But uh, yeah, I think that goes without saying, bro. Picking on Asian people for being Asian is a pretty stupid thing to do. And that also goes for any race. Boom. See what I just did, chat? I just ended racism just by that one sentence. Let's go, baby. Anyways, I'm not gonna lie. Darman's videos have gotten a lot better since we watched them last time. I remember they used to just be so busted, but now they got their production quality up quite a bit. Like there was parts of this video where I literally didn't even 
even know what to say, so I just let it roll for like two minutes. I'm sure y'all noticed, but nah, they're getting better. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to drop a like down below and subscribe to the channel. Feel free to join the Discord as well. Uh, you can talk to people, suggest videos for me to watch, whole lot of stuff on there. Go join that shit. And yeah, with that being said, hope you guys have a great rest of your day, and I'll catch y'all later. Peace.